it, it's an interesting, it was an interesting show, so to speak. But it was good to see, it's good to see LeBron and Carmelo's kids playing basketball against one another. Obviously, LeBron and Carmelo grew up in the in the world of basketball. And then you got Scottie Pippen's younger son there as well. So it was a star studded event as always at Sierra Canyon. It wasn't as I thought I would see a little bit more out of them, but for whatever reason, it's high school basketball. This is kind of what you get. <laughs> for me personally, I got to tell you something. I, I I was pretty upset that I left L.A. because um, I would have loved to have gone to the game. I've purposely stayed away from watching LeBron's son all of these years because I always felt like there's so many haters out there for LeBron that people were going to go and try to take that out on his son. And I've always been worried about that. I never wanted to find myself in a position to critique his game or whatever. But I've had people inviting me to come see him and saying, no, you got to go check him out. So I said, oh, you know, one of these days I'm going to go see this kid. I want to go see him play. And the fact that Lamelo, Carmelo's son was playing too, I'm like, damn it. I wish I would have stayed, but I got to get out there to see a uh, uh, Bronny James. I've never I keep ever telling seen you to come to the games but, with me, Stephen. I'm going to come. I'm going to come. I'm going to try to get out there. I'm serious. I'm going to try to fly out there next month. Just you would, you would fit. Play. You would fit right into the crowd with no problem. What you trying to say? <laughs> oh God! What you trying to say? What you trying to say, yeah. Keyshawn? It's one of those crowds, man. But what, what, what crowd? Put it this way: I'm supposed to be with you. It's a so MSG, about you. It's an MSG Laker crowd, kind of on a younger kind of combined. That's what you're gonna see. All of that stuff. Well, let me ask you a question: Did you you, you gonna you gonna threaten to beat anybody up while while while, while I'm there? No, you know, it's you, more, you, it's you, more, you, hey, get, it's you more security. It's more security there than the UN. You don't have to worry about it, buddy. Cool. All right. Go ahead, Jay. Listen, I, I went. I was in the same high school class as Carmelo. Uh, he's still mad at me for winning the McDonald's MVP award <laughs> over him. Uh, LeBron was a LeBron was a year older, and I just I can't imagine as a father. I have an eight-year-old son, Knox, who, who just started playing this fall, and I'm, I'm helping coach his team. I can't imagine as a father, you know, watching uh, your your kids play against each other on national television in front of Channing Tatum of all people. So a little shot of Channing Tatum there with Carmelo. I got to say one thing. I am a bit worried about you coaching kids. Because oh, wow. if, if a kid comes <laughs> and he wow. says, now, now you, you, you're fine as long as they give effort. But if they come to you, because you know kids tend to act like they know stuff they don't know. Uh -huh. And coming to you, you don't have much patience for people that oh, come at you like wow. that. You might lose. Wow. You, you might forget their kids. And, and J.J. might get on them a little bit. He might be a little bit too rough on them, Key. He might be a little bit too rough on them. I had I had yeah. my first my first coach game coaching was on Sunday. I it was just the assistant coach. We won the game. The coach called me afterwards. He was like, "We'd love it if you'd be the head coach." Mm -hmm. So I'm like, "Great." I, my wheels start spinning, right. and I start thinking about how I'm going to start talking to these see, kids. See, and then I was like, "I got to dial it back." And how old are they? Nobody will get more. eight. Nobody will get more tech. <laughs> no coach. I predict this. No coach in the league will get more technical fouls than JJ yeah. Redick. I promise JJ's you that. JJ's trying to figure out. I just want a fair game. I just want a fair game. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.